In the contemporary world, filled with hustle and noise, the concept of silence often emerges as a daunting aspect, a vast emptiness that triggers feelings of discomfort and vulnerability. We habitually scramble to break the quiet, attempting to evade the unease it induces. Contrary to this perspective, Stoicism introduces the notion that silence transcends merely concealing truths or avoiding complications. It is a potent medium for cultivating serenity and enhancing psychological resilience. I recall a scenario shared by a litigator who leverages silence tactically in the courtroom. When it appears a witness has concluded their testimony, he intentionally pauses, allowing a tense atmosphere to envelop the room. This deliberate quietude frequently prompts the witness to speak further, potentially leading to revealing errors. This exemplifies that silence is not merely an absence of noise, but a profound communicator, illustrating that constant dialogue is not requisite for understanding the dynamics of communication and silence. Epictetus advised us to favor silence over speaking indiscriminately, suggesting that in every utterance and moment of reticence, we not only demonstrate respect for others, but also for ourselves, fostering self-awareness and a richer comprehension of both our inner self and our surroundings. Are you intrigued by the enigmatic force of silence? Let's embark on a collective exploration into pivotal instances where choosing silence becomes indispensable. Before we delve deeper, it's imperative to engage with the entire discourse without overlooking any part, as each segment offers valuable insights into the critical role of silence in our lives. Number 1. Mastering Anger Management At various times we have all experienced the heavy feeling of anger welling up inside us. This could arise during a challenging moment, trying to collaborate on a project with a colleague, the heartache of realizing a relationship is coming to an end, or feeling overlooked by a loved one. Anger tends to emerge swiftly, like a sudden storm, undermining rationality and leaving a wake of regret and sorrow. In such instances, the principles of Stoicism provide a pathway to navigate these intense emotions with a blend of rational thought and empathy. Take inspiration from Seneca, a Stoic philosopher who, upon facing betrayal by a close friend, refrained from reacting in anger. Instead, Seneca contemplated the situation and recognized that the fallout from anger is often more harmful than the provocation itself. He chose to approach the betrayal with empathy and understanding, acknowledging the internal struggles we all endure. To effectively handle anger, the foremost step is to recognize and openly accept it. This doesn't imply suppressing or denying your feelings, but rather embracing them as an intrinsic aspect of human nature. Delve into the root cause of your anger, whether it's stemming from a feeling of powerlessness in an unchangeable situation or frustration due to expectations not being met. Identifying the true cause enables you to apply stoic reasoning to view the situation more calmly and objectively, keeping in mind that anger often exacerbates the issue rather than resolving it. Transforming anger into a more manageable state involves a mindful approach and self-awareness. Start by paying attention to the initial signs of anger, such as clenched fists, a rapid heartbeat, or muscle tension. Recognizing these early warnings is crucial to prevent the escalation of anger. When you notice anger rising, give yourself a moment to step away from the situation. If needed, apologize and take some time to calm down, which could avert regrettable reactions later on. Incorporate relaxation techniques like deep breathing, meditation, or progressive muscle relaxation to lessen both the physical and emotional impact of anger. Finding constructive outlets for expressing your anger is also important. Talk about your feelings with a trusted individual, write them down, or channel the energy into physical activity. 
Be aware of specific triggers that spark your anger and work towards minimizing your exposure to these through clear communication of your needs, setting boundaries, or making lifestyle adjustments. It's also beneficial to challenge any negative thought patterns that contribute to your anger, considering their validity and opening yourself up to different perspectives. Empathy plays a significant role in managing anger. Trying to understand the viewpoint of others, even when you disagree, can mitigate feelings of anger and lead to more positive interactions. If anger is affecting your quality of life, don't hesitate to seek professional guidance. A therapist or psychologist can provide valuable strategies for emotional regulation. Maintaining a healthy lifestyle through regular exercise, a nutritious diet, sufficient sleep and moderation in substance use can have a positive impact on your emotional well-being and help in reducing anger. Lastly, Embracing forgiveness towards yourself and others can lower anger levels, facilitating emotional healing and peace. Mastering anger management is an ongoing process that requires time and dedication. Practice patience with yourself and recognize the small victories along your path to better managing anger. Number 2. Navigating Unfairness Facing injustice is more than a challenge to our sense of fairness. It's a crucial test of our spiritual resilience. Stoic philosophy offers guidance not just on tempering our reactions, but also on finding inner tranquility amidst turmoil. For Stoics, maintaining silence doesn't imply passivity or acquiescence, but represents a powerful, deliberate choice that empowers us to confront and transcend injustices without compromising our serenity. Consider a scenario where, despite your diligent work and dedication to your job, a promotion is awarded to a colleague with less experience. This situation may strike a blow to your self-esteem and sense of fairness. However, rather than yielding to anger or disenchantment, you opt to reflect on the situation. This reflection involves reassessing your professional worth and aspirations. It's essential to not let negative emotions cloud your judgment. Instead, focus on enhancing your skills and broadening your knowledge. This example illustrates how maintaining composure and introspection enables us not only to avoid harming others or ourselves through rash reactions, but also to discover our true strength. In the face of injustice, choosing silence is not merely a tactic for emotional defense, but a pathway to uncovering the most effective and thoughtful course of action. Silence fosters a deeper connection with our core values, laying a strong foundation for meaningful action. As Marcus Aurelius remarked, silence is the most fitting reply to anger. By choosing silence over anger or negative reactions, we maintain control and cultivate a positive outlook on life's challenges. This approach doesn't just aid in managing difficulties with grace, it also fortifies our resilience and adaptability in various circumstances. Embracing the power of silence equips us to tackle life's challenges head on. It's about transforming obstacles into opportunities for personal growth as encouraged by Stoic philosophy. Becoming more resilient and independent is a journey marked by numerous emotions in the face of unfairness, including frustration, anger, disappointment, and sorrow. However, your response to such treatment significantly impacts both the situation at hand and your well-being. When confronted with unfairness, it's crucial to fully embrace and acknowledge your emotions without trying to suppress them, as recognizing and accepting these feelings is essential for your mental health. Taking a step back to assess the situation objectively can provide clarity, allowing you to understand the underlying reasons for your sense of injustice and to consider any perspectives you might have missed initially. Discussing the issue with a trusted friend or confidant can offer new insights and help you see the situation from a different viewpoint. 
It's important to respond thoughtfully rather than impulsively, carefully weighing your options to ensure your actions are both informed and constructive. Communicating your feelings and concerns assertively and directly to the involved parties, explaining your stance and what you believe would rectify the situation is a vital step. Focus your efforts on the aspects of the situation within your control rather than fixating on those that are not to make a positive impact through your actions and attitude. In cases of significant injustice, pursuing resolution through formal channels like filing a complaint or seeking legal counsel may be necessary. Dealing with unfairness can be emotionally draining so prioritizing self-care through activities that promote relaxation and recovery is essential. Releasing any resentment you may hold is also crucial, as holding on to bitterness can negatively affect your long-term health. Forgiving is more about granting yourself peace than absolving others. Lastly, view your experiences with unfairness as opportunities for personal growth. Reflecting on how you can handle similar situations more adeptly in the future. This comprehensive approach not only helps you deal with the immediate effects of unfairness, but also aids in your personal development, making you better equipped to face future challenges. Number 3. Maneuvering through the tempest of insults. Before delving into the third lesson, let's reflect on the story of Cato, a renowned Stoic philosopher and statesman renowned for his steadfast adherence to his principles. Despite being the subject of mockery by his contemporaries for his staunch ethics, Cato's resolve never faltered. His life embodies the Stoic conviction that our true strength is rooted in our beliefs rather than external approval or recognition. Our lives invariably encounter turbulent phases but Stoics approach such times with a clear perspective. They don't resort to denial or pretense when faced with insults. Rather, they understand that the opinions of others are merely personal perceptions that do not alter one's intrinsic worth. This realization enables them to concentrate on what is within their power to change rather than what isn't. Mastering one's emotions is a fundamental Stoic practice especially amidst a barrage of insults. Stoics strive to maintain a serene and untroubled spirit, confronting every provocation with equanimity and resilience. However, the essence of Stoicism isn't just about emotion regulation, it's also about maintaining an objective viewpoint. Stoics regard insults as an inevitable aspect of existence, unworthy of disrupting one's mental peace. Rather than responding with anger or feeling wounded, they aim to keep their reasoning unclouded, enabling them to navigate situations wisely and effectively. Moreover, Stoicism emphasizes empathy and forbearance. Faced with disparagement, Stoics might opt for silence or a kind response to diffuse tension, fostering more constructive exchanges. Navigating the storm of insults then is not merely about evasion, but involves a journey of growth, embracing wisdom, patience, persistence, and determination. Stoic philosophy holds the key to living a liberated and tranquil life, even amidst the most challenging circumstances. Number four, handling gossip gracefully. Gossip and wrongful criticism are inevitable aspects of human interaction. The crucial factor isn't the occurrence of such challenges, but our approach to navigating and overcoming them. Stoicism, advocating for patience and self-control, provides valuable strategies for confronting gossip with poise and resilience. When confronted with unfounded rumors, it's natural to feel a surge of anger or panic. However, Stoicism counsels us to employ reason to assess the situation from a detached perspective and to respond with understanding. Opting for silence rather than rushing to defend our honor embodies a powerful and deliberate choice. This silence, far from indicating weakness, 
signals strength, self-discipline, and the confidence to let truth and time vindicate use. True strength emanates not from a reactive disposition, but through the calm and wise endurance of trials. This doesn't imply passive resignation, but rather choosing a path of strategic patience. Envision yourself in a high-paced corporate environment, rife with rumors, including one that misconstrues your promotion as pandering to a superior. This scenario presents an ideal opportunity to practice stoic principles. Rather than succumbing to distress or confrontation, you choose to approach the situation with composure and clarity, engaging in a candid conversation with your boss to address and dispel the rumors. Facing gossip offers not only a test, but also an opportunity to fortify your patience, confidence and resilience. Engaging with gossip directly, when necessary, involves confronting the source with tact and expressing the impact of their words, advocating for an end to the spreading of harmful rumors. Setting boundaries is another effective strategy, signaling your disinterest in participating in or being the subject of gossip, thereby fostering a more positive and constructive discourse. Building a supportive network and focusing on positive interactions can eclipse the negativity brought by gossip. However, if gossip escalates to a level that affects your well-being or transitions into harassment, seeking support from trusted individuals or professionals is advisable. Documenting instances of malicious gossip and reporting them to appropriate authorities like HR departments or school administrations, is crucial in cases where gossip crosses the line into bullying. Ultimately, the power lies in your response to the words and actions of others. By remaining steadfast to your values and striving to cultivate a healthier social environment, you navigate through gossip not just with grace, but as a person of integrity and resilience. Number 5. Navigating Unfair Criticism Facing unwarranted criticism can instinctively prompt a defensive stance. Yet Epictetus introduces an alternative approach. Rather than hastily defending your actions or pointing out your unnoticed flaws in retaliation, embrace this as an opportunity for self-awareness and restraint. This stance is particularly vital in confronting unjust criticism, a common challenge for many. A Stoic's initial response to irrational critique is to find serenity and resist the urge for immediate rebuttal. By absorbing and reflecting upon the criticism, a display of self-control emerges, not just as a testament to personal strength, but as a distinguishing mark of respectability. Stoics acknowledge life's inherent fairness and understand that true liberation of the mind comes from comprehension rather than resistance. They don't condone injustice by accepting it, rather they recognize their limitations in altering certain outcomes. In instances where defense seems futile, silence becomes a sanctuary. This silence is not a mark of defeat, but a demonstration of mastery over the situation preventing an unjust critique from escalating into a relentless conflict. Embracing silence is a testament to confidence, not vulnerability. Stoicism teaches that strength is not solely manifested through vocal opposition, but also through the judicious exercise of silence. In a realm frequently marred by undue criticism and injustice, the Stoic philosophy offers a path to resilience and autonomy. It advocates for a life of integrity and patience, suggesting that by acknowledging the truth, valuing the power of silence, and adhering to righteousness, we not only cultivate a fulfilling existence for ourselves, but also inspire hope and faith in a tumultuous world. Number 6. Navigating Through Loss the inevitability of loss is a profound truth of existence, bringing with it deep emotional turmoil and challenging times. Loss manifests in various forms, from the grief of losing a loved one, the void left by job loss, to the emptiness felt, 
from parting with something deeply cherished. These experiences, though harrowing, are integral to the human journey, often leaving us feeling adrift in a sea of despair. In confronting loss, the paramount lesson is to embrace and comprehend the transience of all things. Life's journey is akin to navigating a tempestuous sea where finding peace and stability is crucial not just for enduring difficult periods, but also for achieving lasting happiness and fulfillment. Through mental fortitude and patience, we're equipped to face any adversity with insight and resolve. Stoicism, however, doesn't advocate for emotional detachment or evasion. Instead, it encourages the acceptance of our feelings in their entirety, managing them with balance and mindfulness. This approach allows us to lead lives rich in meaning, appreciating every moment, be it joyous or sorrowful. Addressing loss is profoundly personal and varies significantly across individuals, but there are universal strategies that may ease the pain. Allowing oneself to grieve openly, without judgment of how we express our sadness, is crucial. Embracing the full spectrum of emotions, whether it's sadness, anger, guilt or numbness, is part of the healing process. Seeking support from friends, family or support groups can provide comfort and understanding in these trying times. Sharing your grief can diminish the feeling of isolation that often accompanies loss. Self-care is also essential. It's important to prioritize your well-being even when it feels challenging. Finding ways to memorialize what was lost can offer a sense of closure and honor their memory, whether through rituals, acts of service, or creative expression. Mindfulness practices like deep breathing, meditation, and staying present can anchor you during waves of intense emotion offering insights into your inner self and facilitating acceptance. It's natural to experience fluctuating emotions and showing kindness and compassion towards oneself during these ebbs and flows is vital. Reflecting on personal beliefs about life, death and the hereafter can provide solace and perspective during periods of mourning. Everyone's journey through loss is unique necessitating personalized paths toward healing. The key is to approach this process with kindness, patience and gentleness, allowing yourself the space and time to navigate through this difficult period of adjustment and recovery. Number seven, the stoic response to boasting. In daily life, we're invariably confronted with challenges, and Stoic philosophy posits that self-discipline is often central to addressing these difficulties. Silence in this context isn't merely an absence of speech, but a manifestation of tranquility, patience, and a profound connection with both oneself and the surrounding world. When faced with praise or admiration, it's crucial to maintain a stance of mental autonomy, resisting the allure of vanity and self-satisfaction. Such a perspective ensures that one's sense of self-worth remains untethered from external validation or the fluctuating opinions of others. The challenge of eschewing ego, especially within a culture that often celebrates self-aggrandizement and accolades, cannot be understated. Opting out of the incessant competition for recognition can feel isolating and daunting. However, embracing mental sovereignty and patience is invaluable. When others offer praise or accolades, choosing to respond with silence is not a display of indifference, but a demonstration of strength and contemplation. Ultimately, maintaining silence in the face of flattery is not merely about exerting self-control. It's about cultivating an internal sanctuary of peace and spiritual liberty. In a society that sometimes exalts vanity and self-promotion, Stoicism teaches that silence bears witness to inner fortitude and discipline. Number 8. Sailing Stoically Through the Ocean of Ignorance In the voyage of life, we often navigate through vast oceans of uncertainty where the tumultuous waves of the unknown constantly challenge our resilience. 
These moments of ambiguity are not merely obstacles from external forces, but are also avenues for introspection and mastery over oneself. In these times of trial, Stoicism serves as a beacon, illuminating the path to confronting the unknown with equanimity and fortitude. Embarking on this journey through murky waters, we might feel adrift. Yet, Stoicism enlightens us to embrace the inherent nature of not knowing as not just a transitory phase, but as a fundamental aspect of existence. Recognizing the limits of our foresight is a step towards embracing opportunities for exploration, learning, and personal evolution. Confronting the unpredictable does not entail surrender or succumb to fear. Moreover, embracing silence in moments of uncertainty is not a display of defeat, but a testament to strength and self-assurance. Silence grants us the space to regulate our emotions, engage in self-reflection, and become more attuned to our own and others' sentiments. Through a stoic response to the unknown, we emerge not only unscathed, but fortified, gaining resilience and insight. This journey through the uncharted territories of life is more than a mere passage. It is a profound exploration of existence itself. To navigate the seas of ignorance with stoic grace involves cultivating a mindset and practices that anchor us in tranquility, resilience and logic amidst the unanswerable. Embracing our finite understanding is a crucial step, fostering humility and openness to learning. Stoicism guides us to focus on what lies within our power, our emotions, actions, and willingness to learn, and to let go of what we cannot influence. Mindfulness keeps us anchored in the present, enhancing our awareness of our mental and emotional landscape without harsh judgment. Building resilience is pivotal, viewing every encounter with the unknown as an opportunity for growth and enrichment, keeping an inquisitive mind and seeking knowledge actively while also accepting the inevitability of unanswered questions are key. Rationality becomes our compass, guiding us through uncertainty with reasoned thought and inquiry. Acknowledging the presence of the unknowable as an integral part of life allows us to invest our energy in constructive pursuits. Developing virtues such as patience, courage, wisdom and resilience empowers us to maintain our composure and integrity in the face of adversity. Engaging regularly with Stoic wisdom, drawing from the insights of philosophers like Epictetus, Marcus Aurelius and Seneca, equips us with the tools to manage ignorance. Practicing gratitude for our current knowledge and for the opportunities to expand our horizons shifts our focus from the limitations of our understanding to the wealth of our experiences and insights. By adhering to these principles and habits, we can gracefully sail through the vast expanses of ignorance, remaining poised and steadfast, even when the path ahead is obscured. In doing so, we embrace the Stoic philosophy not just as a theoretical guide, but as a practical compass for life's journey, enabling us to face the vast unknown with a calm spirit and a heart ready for whatever lies ahead. This Stoic voyage through ignorance teaches us not only about the world around us, but also reveals the depths of our own inner strength and the boundless potential for personal growth and understanding. Number 9. Mastering Silence Amidst Unfounded Gossip Silence, far from merely being the absence of words, emerges as a deliberate and insightful strategy particularly in navigating the treacherous waters of misinformation. From a Stoic perspective, choosing silence in the face of baseless rumors isn't an indication of powerlessness, but a testament to an underlying fortitude and resilience. By embracing silence, we not only provide ourselves the space to ponder and critically assess situations with depth, but also reinforce our commitment to not being swayed by unsubstantiated claims or criticisms. 
In the realm of Stoicism, silence transcends mere non-response. It embodies a state of composure and patience. It is within this quietude that we discover a profound sense of liberation and inner vigor, enabling us to confront and surmount challenges with both resolve and clarity. Silence, thus, is not an act of evasion or defeat, but a demonstration of certainty and poise. The Stoic understanding of silence extends beyond simple quietness to signify a potent form of psychological resilience and proactive stance. In the hush, Stoics harness the strength to dismiss unfounded allegations and uphold their ethical convictions without allowing rumors to erode their self-assurance or principles. Silence serves as a sanctuary, safeguarding the spirit and intellect from the corrosive effects of external negativity. Choosing to remain silent bestows upon us tranquility and mastery over our emotions, bolstering our capacity to advocate for truth and integrity. It is through this introspective silence that we truly grasp its essence, not as a marker of vulnerability, but as a clear indication of mental robustness and thoughtful discernment. 10. Embracing Silence Amid Uncertainty In today's whirlwind of tumult and bewilderment, encountering ambiguity and challenges is an inevitable aspect of existence. Embracing silence amidst these uncertainties transcends mere choice. It manifests as an art form and a distinguished facet of Stoic practice. As we navigate through the tempestuous sea of information overload and convoluted reasoning, choosing silence emerges as a formidable tool. Opting for silence rather than hastily responding to every provocation or confusion allows for a sanctuary of calm in the midst of turmoil. This practice of silence, especially when the path forward is obscured, is not just a prudent approach, but also a spiritual demonstration of autonomy and wisdom. However, to truly harness the power of silence in times of doubt requires discipline. It's about cultivating self-restraint, ensuring that the vicissitudes of the external environment do not disturb our inner equilibrium. Learning to remain composed and to welcome the unknown without succumbing to apprehension and dread is crucial. Silence is where we encounter tranquility and a stoic mindset, reminding us that maintaining silence in the face of the unpredictable is not merely a tactical choice, but a profound philosophical commitment, harnessing silence as a testament to strength. In the realm of stoic wisdom, silence is not just an absence of speech. It is a profound demonstration of resilience guiding us through the myriad hurdles life throws our way. It's in the embrace of silence that we often discover the deepest insights about our inner selves and the complexities of the environment that surrounds us. Here, we explore 10 moments where opting for silence becomes a profound act of self-discovery, listening, respect, and a marker of emotional maturity. This practice transcends mere personal growth offering a pathway to spiritual liberation and serenity. Choosing to remain silent, especially in challenging circumstances, serves as a shield against impulsive reactions, nurturing a soul marked by patience, wisdom, and empathy. Silence thus morphs into an invaluable instrument, sharpening our ability to tackle issues with enhanced intellect and humanity. This commitment to silence seeks not only to enrich the individual journey, but also to positively influence the collective ethos of our communities. We invite you to engage in this journey to contribute to a robust community bound by the mutual exchange of love and wisdom. Your insights and reflections are invaluable. Share them in the comments to foster a dialogue on the aspects of silence that resonate most with you. Don't forget to subscribe to stay updated with essential life teachings and the stoic pursuit of mental cultivation. Together, let's endeavor to create a more enlightened and introspective world.